big welcome to the All Blacks at Lansdowne Road. President de Valera shakes hands with J.C. Kelly, Ireland's captain. Few in the mostly Irish crowd expect the home country to win. Playing left to right, the New Zealanders begin with the confidence generated by a great tradition and a good record on the present tour. But as many visiting sides have found out, the Irish always take a lot of beating before a Dublin crowd. Scrum half Kelly inspires his men. Right wing fortune dashes to the line, a try for Ireland. Left wing three quarter Duggan makes it five points to Ireland. The All Blacks aren't used to this sort of thing. They pile on the pressure, all out to draw level before the interval. By skill and fighting spirit, the Irish defenders hold firm. At last, ST Mead sends Tremaine away. Try for the All Blacks, unconverted. Half-time, Ireland lead 5-3. The kind of situation to spur on both teams. Harry Winnie tries for a drop goal. It's bad luck for the Irish to be penalised for a minor scrum infringement. D.B. Clark takes the kick and scores. So, by the unsatisfactory scoring system of rugby, the All Blacks win 6-5.